what's a couple of more hours. We're about ready to resume our championship tilt. John Tillman's underdog Terrapins. Point producer, he's the younger brother of Matt. This has been a dream of his, his entire life to win national championships. He won one last year with last season's MVP. He's got a ring. He is Spider-Man-like with his movement from pipe to pipe. You got Logan McNeil. Two of the best face-off men in the country. Will Lynch for Notre Dame. Luke Weirman for Maryland. And Weirman jumped face-off violation number one on Notre Dame. Maryland knocked off two ACC teams. Duke in the quarters. Virginia in the semifinals after a thrashing of Princeton in round one. Left-handed shot by Syracuse. And the un... Watch it, he'll point to his chest after this one goes by his stick. He it's a team that's only lost once this season. They've won 13 in a row. Jordan Faison had three goals, two assists in Notre Dame's regular season meeting with Maryland and an unforced error. Teller. Here's Zach Whittier against the short stick D Mitty Nick Harris. Shot on the run, too high. In lacrosse, closest last 38 games. And they've won every NCAA tournament game this year by at least five goals. Pat Cavanaugh right down the middle. Just missed high, the backup to his brother Chris. Keeping their defense fresh. Syracuse had it pop out of his stick. He recovers. Checked by Christian Alakwa. Good look here. Bounce shot, and it goes in. Nothing, Maryland. The delay. Eric Loose as a goose. They're playing with house money. College Park knows it. It's known as a big left-handed hired gun. Losing kill and Riley Gray. Terps were in this situation a couple of years ago in the semis. They had a delay of three and a half hours against Princeton. Taylor bottled up near the crease. Angrick shoots. Notre Dame on the board. One more up top. Everybody eats, everybody shares the rock. Angrick, a year removed. So, Irks are the Big Ten freshman of the year last season. This is Whittier now. Fires on the run, Entman makes the save. Irish in transition. Pat Cavanaugh to Taylor, that's too easy. game as good as it gets the deception here is subtle but it is absolutely nasty you look at the dip of the head in Notre Dame's top scoring midfielder a transfer from Brown here's the matchup Pat Cavanaugh against Zapatello Cavanaugh the question mark and the save made by McManey Logan the two-man game Cavanaugh was looking for the switch trying to get the shorty now brother Chris Booze and kill, Philly area native. Second point of this national championship and Notre Dame has the lead for the first time. They buckle your chin strap. If you're the Irish, you have Liam Entman. Big save capability. And you Second meeting of this season between these two teams. Notre Dame won the first meeting 14 to nine back on March 3rd. Maryland with the Ejac Cadillac Chorus. He plays offense, he plays defense, he roams to the middle of the field. They all have the catapult system to track their GPS and mileage. This could be some opportunities from some of these outside shooters like an Eric Dobson. And Ajax Zapatello told his unit, we cannot allow them to score six on six. Third midfield on for Notre Dame. And the Jalen Seymour, the ninth goal of his career, the fourth the this season. The best passer in school history. In Pat Cavanaugh dealing, people cut. Here is Faison. Five points against Maryland back in March, his best game of the regular season. Now Dobson, an All-American with a lefty hammer. Fires on the run. That lefty laser. The wide receiver for Marcus Freeman in the Fighting Irish. He attracts the long stick. You have a six-foot. Long Island, now booze and kill. Two points in this first quarter. 
Angrich's got a goal. Shoots on the run. McNaney got a piece. That's his friend. MVPs McNaney in 2022 for the Terps. Entman last season for the Fighting Irish. Angrich bouncer on the run. It'll stay with Notre Dame at 7 p.m. Picks in lacrosse, very similar to what you'll see with picks in the NBA. Syracuse with the right hand. Entman with the save. Looking for the outlet for opponents of Notre Dame is razor thin. Dobson's got the short stick red. He's seen a lot of short sticks this season, and he's been able to do that. Evan McLean, Notre Dame's top scoring midfielder. It's now a six. He does. He has been cooking in this first half, and Devin McLean's been the cherry on the wing. Bolivar against Harris. Another short stick matchup. Bolivar turns, fires way too high. The bat against Stamos. Shot clock inside of 15. Down to 10. Chris Cavanaugh snakes and stings. There's two. They're daring Chris Cavanaugh to go left. And if you look at the map, they inspire. And that doesn't come from us, that comes from their teammates. Chris Cavanaugh low to too high. Pat Cavanaugh on front of us, in front of them by shaking it so much during the course of the game. Certain grit and competitive excellence. Here's Chris Cavanaugh, gets free, fires, scores. Downhill, they're on an 8-1 run. And they've got a five-goal lead on Maryland. Catch. This is dangerous. Slicing his way through this Terp defense. How about the awareness to feel that over the head? Zapatello marking Pat Cavanaugh. Flips it back to his brother Chris. Right hand free. It whistles wide. Who's the guy that is going to complete a comeback for them? Well, they did it against Duke in the quarterfinals, a game you covered. Well, they've got to figure out <laughs> three goals in a row for Chris Cavanaugh, a first half hat trick. A little bit of a backhand beauty. Older brother to younger brother. And this is improv and backyard at its best. You Maltz shovels to Spanos. Pinballs off Alakwa. 15 to shoot. Feeding inside. Shot altered. Running the weave up top. Pat Cavanaugh using the pick from Gray. Zapatello on him. Gray against Alfiti. Shoots low. The second midfield strikes again for Notre Dame. And the Irish lead by seven. On the offensive end, Cavanaugh dicing up, up top. Riley Gray has been... Five seconds left before we get back to full strength. Skip pass. Terps could not really get inside. Couldn't get much. Skip pass on the crease. Finally! They answer the bell. It's Marlboro. Defense is so compact because they have a goalie like Liam Entman. The seam is that skip. Pat Cavanaugh, four assists in the first half. One point away from 300 for his career. Cavanaugh behind the back. McNaney did get a piece of that one. 20 to shoot. McLean played attack at Brown. Inside roll. Turned aside by Sharkey. Now Faison near the crease. McNaney saved two in a row. Back gets it through. And is like Cannon at lefty. More than 20 goals. Freshman midfielder out of Pinecrest, Florida. There to support Notre Dame lacrosse at Arlotta. Yes, they stuck around too. And he was a little quiet in the first half. And then he had a behind the back goal. In front of all of his boys, they erupted. Shirts off, ball, and lacrosse is such a natural. Think about guys like Will Shipley, who played at Clemson. NFL draft choice. Taylor near the crease. Dante. Maybe a look here. Brennan hesitates. Skips it. Mm. Antiman after wow. a slow start. Starting to get hot. Now Carnage near the crease. Both in the game. Your stick's got to travel so far. Pat Cavanaugh to brother Chris, going low, kiss the stone. With that goal, defense 
Chris gets Kavanaugh him too much real estate from the wing. And Chris Cavanaugh now having a May moment. Yes. I was in the driver's seat right now for the Tawartan Award, which factors in performance in the month of May. Angrick skips, doorstep, slam. How about five goals for Chris Cavanaugh? His brother's got five assists today. The Irish have opened up a nine ball and inside. Chorus working on Parlet. Now Spanos, jump shot left hand. Antonin, the veto power. Finley, a Georgia native. Seymour thought about it from the wing. That one hisses offline. Two is he mastered playing off the ball. Five six of the time you're away from the ball. You don't have to be a cover guy. Jake Taylor. McNaney stopped it with his rare, finds it. Good to see Lock now about to go inside of 10. Syracusa against Ramsey. Maltz from long distance. Four to shoot. Word got to him that dad's playing in the national championship. Well, dad is a heck of a lacrosse coach. Woo! Fisher Finley. Another exclamation. That's that third midfield. Just a Did you say of midfield depth? This is a hammer of a shot by Fisher Finley. Against Duke's first team, against Virginia's first team. Today they've scored now twice against Maryland's first team. They just wear you out, and they've had valuable minutes. Terps. That's a, a gorgeous pump and go on the yeah, wing. The key to that hitch is how wide his base was. The wider the base is on the hitch, the more the defender turns I've with with Paul Rabel and Kyle Harrison. Right. Yeah. Right. There's there's always a player or two you associated with. Pat Cavanaugh has five assists today. His brother Chris. Alvidi for for Maryland. Hit from behind, and are we going to get a flag? And Notre Dame has been running downhill since. Booze and kill. Save McNaney. From that weather delay, didn't have the greatest warm up. It was pouring rain. Footing was a little bit off. But you watched the way that he progressed through this game, and it was only a matter of. Not have against Notre Dame. You need your goalie to play well. And McNaney, who's been so good, especially on this stage, did not have a save in the first half. Entman, meanwhile, it's Pat Cavanaugh. Kevin Corrigan and Notre Dame have been playing incredible defense for decades, and they've had some amazing goalies. Entman, the best, but you think of the Scotty Rogers game. That competitive grit, that competitive excellence. Uh, Pat Cavanaugh, to me, is, is an all-timer. Not only is he a Tuarton winner this year. Wow! I'll tell you what, I know it's garbage time, so to speak. It's That's going to be a flag. Stamos came over. Taylor, Pat Cavanaugh gets the assist, his sixth of the game, and Jake Taylor. This is always there. Excellent. They are so full of life, authentic joy, competitive spirit. Pat by his side for these first three years. What an incredible run. Here's the vaunted, dare I say, third midfield, Bryce Walker. All the glitters is still gold. Notre Dame makes it back to back. <laughs> Kark. He's complaining they ruined his With COVID in 2020, the Kavanaugh brothers have shepherded this program, this proud program to new heights. They keep the title in South Bend.